Good morning, afternoon, and evening from wherever you are watching from. Welcome to Belinda's Country Living. Today is Friday, and it is Senior Food and Household Item Hall. I was able to get to go this time. I got someone to sit in with Miss Wilma. So I am going to show you what I was blessed with today. I want to thank each and every one of you for watching my videos. I appreciate all my subscribers. If you're new to my channel, I want to welcome you. And please remember to give me that thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I haven't been doing very many videos this last month. I've been caring for Sweet Wilma. So um, I got her out of the hospital, emergency room. I believe it was Tuesday night at, or Wednesday morning, 4.30. I was in the emergency room for seven hours. Anyway, I am going to flip you around and show you what I was blessed with. Okay, I received um, French bread, a loaf of wide pan bread, 100%, whole wheat, one package of well, it's just one croissant, a bag of apples, two pineapples, we got a bag of premium gold, small potatoes, got a few peaches there. We got more blessed with several containers of grapes. So we got two bags of red seedless table grapes. We got two bags of them. And then we got Bow Juicy Delight Midnight Beauty grapes. We received some sweet potatoes. A can of green beans, unsweetened applesauce, diced tomatoes, organic peas pasta, parmesan, and we got some sweetener blend, stevia, beef flavored, romaine or Rayman, I don't know if I'm saying that right. Noodle soup. We got two containers of Kroger brand coleslaw dressing. Now, I've never used that because I always make my own because all you have to do is have some um, Miracle Whip or salad dressing, some little bit of sugar and some vinegar, and you have slaw mix. We got a container of Hellman's Real Mayonnaise, organic oregano. We got a Folgers French Roast, and then a bag of Pete's Coffee Dark Roast, chocolate chip waffles, Boys will like that. Wilma may even like that. And we got some spinach and feta cheese chicken meatballs. Now, I've never had that either. A bag of elbow, elbow macaroni. A bag of corn muffin mix. Premium white chicken. And we got beef fine cubes. Now, the best date on that was April 16th. 
I'm not afraid of any of this because all this stuff has been frozen. We got round steak, beef round steak, look at that. And then we got three pork loin chops, center cut, boneless, frozen. Now we will go over to the table. They're not giving very much snacks out and they're saying most of the food pantries are getting kind of low on food. So we did get some Fiesta Twist, tortilla chips, yellow, Cake mix, another box of Girl Scout Thin Mint Cookies, Fruit Loop, two boxes of premium crackers, Oreo cookies, and some more cookies. Let's see what these are. Carrot cake cookies. Oh, I bet you my friend will love them. And then this one is sandwich cookie. Wilma doesn't have no problem eating sweets. And then two maple ice donuts. Some hazelnut. A bag of Cheerios and sweetened bag a bag of mixed candy and of course some more treats going on here Lindor white chocolate well, there's another box of that Stevia sweetener. I will donate that because we don't use that, so we will. I will donate that. Okay, and as far as the household items, we got Reynolds wrap, aluminum foil, clear and focus tablets. They're chewable. Green tea. Oh no. Ibuprofen. They do try to give the seniors things like that. And then we got a bottle of Headquarters Mega Moisturizer Shampoo and Conditioner. Not sure who's that. Who's that made by? But and then we got Girl Scout body wash. I'll be darned, I didn't know Girl Scouts did them. And then we got CVS pain relief lotion. I'm gonna give that to my sister because she has a lot of trouble with her legs, pain in her legs. Then we have rose chip oil, rejuvenating glow oil. And we got a back scratcher. And apple cider vinegar gummies, dietary supplements. Now why would you need to take that? I'm not sure. Then they gave some disposable portion cups for 4th of July. Cute. Some Lysol wipes. And some food handler gloves, final gloves. Two rows of toilet paper. 
large bottle of pine soil. Now, I don't use that, and I don't know if any of you out there has ever used the pine soil, but I'll tell you, I have used it, and I don't like the way it makes my floors feel. Kind of makes it feel like it's got a little sticky residue on it. So I'm going to donate that. And this is a cooling a whist bin. I guess you put that in the freezer. and So, okay. A bag of cat food. I did have a choice of cat food or dog food. And what they had this week was wet dog food. And I don't give my dog... Uh, wet food and then we got a bottle of downy rinse and refresh and some vinegar power powered clean like detoxifying your clothes mm. we got a glade candle they always give out candles. Got one thing of paper towels. We got some water. A monster drink. Uh, we'll donate that. We got some tea. And yeah, so this is what I was blessed with. Did get some chocolate pudding. So most of these snacks, the cookies, the pudding, grapes, and things like that, I'll be taking to Wilma. I have to be back over at Wilma's at 6 this evening. And uh, let me flip you around here. But yeah, I have to be back there at 6 this evening uh, to administer her antibiotics through a pick line. So they came out, a nurse came out and trained me for that. I don't like doing it, but I didn't want to have to take Wilma to the hospital two times a day to do it. So, and that was a five day infusion there. So. Tomorrow will be the last day of her getting the antibiotics. And what she had was a UTI. She was low in potassium. Um, she also has E. coli. And that's what this antibiotic is for, is the E. coli. And uh, But other than that, Wilma seems to be doing good. She has her bad days with the dementia going on. Whew. Let me tell you, she can get pretty mean, but you just got to deal with it. And, um, and what she does do to you, she don't even remember 30 minutes later. So, anyway, that's what I have for y'all today. I want y'all to know I miss uh, doing my cooking and doing the outdoor things. I've been letting things go here at my home because there's just not enough time during the day. Take care of Wilma and come here. And uh, Wilma, if I bring her here within 15 minutes, she's ready to go back home. So there's no, I tried to get her to come and stay with me at least two times a week, but she just won't have it. So that's what I have for you today. And as always, remember, God loves you, and I appreciate all your guys' prayers for Wilma. And please continue praying, and um, the little, um, in my description, I have my address there. If you would like to drop Wilma a line, send her a card. I believe she would really appreciate it. My address is in in the description. Until the next time, remember to always be kind in your words, and may God bless you.